Hello and welcome to another Tales of Middle Earth product review. Uh, today's going to be quite short, sharp and sweet, but we're going to be looking at uh, the Citadel painting handle. Uh, I have to admit I was quite impressed with this, uh, but I've used it a lot already. Uh, first thing we need to discuss is the actual price of it. You know, it's only a fiver. Only a fiver, which you know for a Games Workshop product, that's actually a really good price. Uh, what it's designed for is cut kind of, this is what it looks like. You can uh, adjust this to various different sizes. And what it's designed for, is you pop your miniature into it, slot it into the base, and then when you're painting, uh, you can get you can move the miniature around, you know, get into all the detail. It's a fantastic little thing. Uh, you know, there's not a lot to say about it really. You can do that size base, you can do bigger bases if I can get it in there. Very difficult where you're standing behind a camera. Oh, come on. This is way easier without a camera in front of you. There we go. You know, you can do bases like this in a focus camera. And I think it can do so actually a lot of the ring space is covered, but yeah. It's made from a nice bit of solid plastic, has a fair bit of weight. I was hoping it could do other bases, but uh, I think I think it probably can. It says it can do 25 mil, 40 mil, and 32 mil. I believe we use 25 and 40 for the game really, but if you do have 32 mil, you can. And that's pretty much it. I'm gonna you know it's as I said it's priced at a fiver, which is really affordable. So I am thinking of getting a few more of these, then you can just sort of have if your batch I normally paint, especially like warriors, I normally paint them in batches of three. Three at a time, so I'd have them all lined up, paint a bit, say flesh colour. Pick the next one up, flesh colour, pick the next one up, flesh colour. And as I said, that's really helped me uh, make painting a bit easier already. So uh, yeah, this is, <laughs> as I said, there's not a lot to it. There are other alternatives, there's people make them in woods, but you know, it's a solid, solid bit. Of, you know, so there are alternatives, but this is the one I've, I enjoy, you know, for a fiver, you can't go wrong. So, I'm going to get, you know, free for 15 quid is not, for me, it's not too bad for a Games Workshop product. It's, you know, high quality. So that's it for this one. It's a short, sharp review. Uh, a few minutes long, but it's only a small product. But worthwhile getting in your collection and helping out of your painting. Uh, next time we'll probably be looking at some other bits and pieces that I've got, got on order. But until then, take care. If you enjoyed this video please like and share it and subscribe to the channel for more great content. Game on and continue to support our wonderful hobby.